So, hello everybody! What is going on? It is Kiba Shimaki here, and welcome back to some more Metroid! Last time, we took care of Big Fat Smelly Craid. We have nothing more to do but to, uh, well, get out of Brinstar Depths. And you might be wondering why am I back here in Craid's room? Well, that is because, right here, is an energy tank that is ripe for the picking. Be careful as to not do this on your first run through, because if you do not have the high jump boots, it is very difficult for you to get out of this place without them. You're going to want to try and morph into a morph ball and collect it if you can. If this is the one of six available that you still need to get, I recommend not getting this one because of how kind of annoying it can be to try and grab it. What I would recommend instead is collecting a bunch of the other ones that we've already run across or into in the way. And if you need help in general, you can still collect the energy tanks as they will be an auto refill. So it's good to keep that in mind in the event that you just are in dire need of some help. They can help in a lot of different cases, but that is the primary case that I would make note of for them. Other than that, we have the most annoying room to ever exist. It is the one room that is the bane of all Metroid players that have experienced it at least once, and by lord do they hate this room with a passion. Your literal objective is going to be to try and just knock out these different blocks and put yourself at the best spot you can. Then fire upward, time your jump, and try to put yourself in a better position and just keep scaling it. Be very, very careful as it's very easy to get yourself knocked out of this portion. If you mess it up, you might get frustrated and I don't blame you if you do. But just try to avoid it at all costs, if possible! Huh. Ah! No! No! Okay. Again, this is not too difficult, but you do need to be kind of easy on yourself with it. Just take it nice and slow. Utilize your high jump boots as much as you can. Wait for those to reform because I'm not chancing it. Go. Get to the highest point. Knock it down. And you should be okay from here. Where to, where to go, doesn't really matter, I believe. Though we have come across these two points prior, I would still just be very, very careful. If you want some more missile upgrades, I recommend going through the bottom path first. As well, that gives you the availability to collect some more missile upgrades. Uh, thankfully we have a lot more health to worry to work with now, so I'm not too pressed for health. As I had um, went back and collected a different energy tank. Just so that way I can get my health back to full. Now we go to 245 missiles, which is really nice. Or two, yeah, 245, I believe. Thank you. Go. Get me out of here. And back to this again. Careful. Okay. Cool. And we are good to get out. <laughs> Probably one of the few rooms that will give you slight panics, and probably the biggest frustration in Metroid overall. You may be a, a, your first Metroid game, or you could be a primed person, or you could just be playing this game for the first time. It does not matter, everyone suffers through that room at least once. Two. Three. Four. Five. There we go. Get me out of here. <sighs> Boom. That. Oh, god damn it. I knocked myself down here. No, I messed up. I was supposed to fall. Well, great. That means I gotta go back. Not kidding. Ugh. If you had the ice beam, it would make it easier for you to climb back up, but in the event that you didn't, um, really all you have to do is just make your way back 
with this route. As annoying as it can be. Go. Shouldn't be too difficult. Can you jump, please? Get me out of here. You suck. I hate you. Don't you dare. Yep, that same room that had the fake lava pit. You're gonna want to utilize this room to get out. So let's move on from Brinstar. Finally! We're done with Brinstar. We're done with Norfair for now. And I believe you can really take almost just about any path. Actually, no, I'm only kidding. You need to take this one. This is the only one that's available. Ugh, my leg. God damn you, I swear. Having you be able to jump here as soon as I spawn into the room sucks. Oh, here. Yeah, that's right. Go ahead, spawn on me. Spawn on me and see what happens. Leave me alone. <sighs> Very good. I don't know why you tend to do that, but you do. Which is funny. You're not getting out, Chloe. You have food and you have water. You're not going out and getting pregnant again. Go. So, make our way through. Back at the elevator. We are done with this place. Get me out of Red Star. Even though you could have easily just reset yourself after dying, I would not recommend that. Instead, we're going to go back to Norfair. And... Where we are. I don't need to Brinstar and everything. Grade's already done. By Ridley's already done. Um. I don't know. Okay, yeah, I guess. Alright, we're at. We have to go to the final section. I forget how short this game can be. Honestly. I got confused for where I'm supposed to go next. You have to hear this lovely, lovely music that is Brinstar. I'll be honest, I don't know when's going to be the next time I'll tackle a Metroid game, because this does take a lot of knowledge and a lot of kind of spacing, and my gosh, I get mad at you very easily, so it's not the best idea for me to be playing these types of games. But oh well. Please, thank you. Okay, there's nothing there interesting. Okay. <laughs> oh, come on. Go fast like that. We are good. So, where to from here? Um. Yeah. Alright, cool. We're all set, we're all ready. Let's move! Let's get to the that blue shaft that we always climbed at the start of the game. Go, so, give me all the health. You're gonna wanna try to get as much health as you can. And be ready with maxed out missiles and everything. Cause we have a tough fight coming up and it's not gonna be a gentle one either. Go. Give me all of this. Okay. Fine. Right, yeah, I was like, I'm not gonna make that jump, am I? It really feels like I should be able to pelt you. Now, even though we have the wave beam, we're gonna wanna go grab the ice beam. So, wherever we got it from, whatever upgrades that we have, as good as a wave beam is, you're gonna need the ice beam for the end. Because the ice beam is just what you need. It's a requirement. So even though we don't get to deal as much damage, we get to freeze things, which kind of makes up for it. Die, die, die. Go. Go. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Boom. Grab it, please. Thank you. 
The only reason why I wasn't going forward, I didn't want to fall. Go. Smack, smack, smack. Smack. No! Okay. Now, as for where the ice beam is, I'll be completely honest with you, I don't remember where it was. Where it is, where it was. Wrong thing. Ice beam, ice beam, ice beam, ice beam, ice beam, ice beam. Can't do that. Energy tank. Bombs. Okay, so I have to go from here. Got to go to the golden shaft. maneuver my way through. Okay, I was like, yeah, I'm pretty sure I could jump that high. Nice. Missile expansion. Or not missile expansion, but missiles. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme. I'm greedy, I need all the health I can keep. Okay. Don't only need the missiles on this one. Ooh, there's a lot on the screen. Give me that. Back away. Fire up. Nothing there. Did I go the wrong way? I don't think so. Thank you. Smack. Smack. If you're gonna give me more health though, I'll take that. Anything? Anyone else? So, I think I've already been to this room. Oi! Give me all the health. Before I'd be panicking, but I mean, I have more health than anything, so I'm actually feeling pretty okay. No, the six feet of wrong one, that's six feet of Norfair. Now I'm gonna go this way, I meant to go back then. So I was going probably the right way. Fine. Hello? How in the world did I not hit you? Alone. Let me alone, let me alone, let me alone. Yes, 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 give me all your health. All of you, everything, all of it. Get me out of here. So I took the wrong path just slightly. I'm supposed to go up, I think. Well, even though I have to go to the top of the shaft. Smack, smack, smack. I was supposed to go straight across them, probably. Ugh, my, my leg. No, you're. Mm. Go. Cool. More missiles. Don't really need them though, but I'll take them. So I have to go straight across then. I don't remember. I don't remember where the ice beam is. I'll be honest. But I'm gonna try. I think, actually, I think it was over here. Ah, uh, back up. Go. Just don't fire off anything for now, or else you're gonna slow down the entire screen. Ugh.
Oh, come on. Come on. I really got stuck there. Whatever, it's fine. Go. My house back. Trying to keep on moving. That was an energy tank, I think that was. So I think I might be going the wrong way. Uh, jump. Samus. Thank you. Go. To the end. There we go, I think it was this golden shaft. I think it's like a certain point. So, is it this room? I think it was this room. So, just keep on running, keep on firing. Don't worry about any health. I think was it this one? I guessed incorrectly. Damn it! Ah. <sighs> So where is it? Where is the ice beam? Leave me alone. So then where was it? So it's not that room. Is it higher up in here? I remember it being in one of these shafts, I just don't remember which one. Uh, I can't even scale the rest of this place because I don't have the ice beam. Damn it! I know we can't go lower, so... Where is it? Go... Just use our invincibility to get through most of this. Yeah, that's right, you thought you could cheese me again like you used to. Sorry, not this time, not today, not any time, not anymore. It was in this room, wasn't it? I remember one of these rooms, we had a bomb to get to it. Was it this one? Ah, there was a room I could have bombed. You guys were probably yelling at me about that the whole time. It's here, isn't it? Damn! Super short room. I think it was this one. I was just off of it on slightly, huh? Yep. The Ice Beam! All right, there we go. So now that we have it, yep, we're able to freeze everything that gets in our way. Now with that, we're set and ready. Next time, we're gonna go to the final area, Torian. And where to get to there, well, we need to go back to the blue chef, and scale to the top, which is what I'll be, I guess I'll meet you guys back here for. That's really all that we have left to do. Hope you guys did enjoy, though. Hope you all continue to enjoy. And I'll, of course, be seeing all you dudes next time. Peace out, everybody.